Craig Lawrence, who you will meet at the beginning of many of these videos, these storytelling videos, was the original and ongoing organizer of the Slocan Valley Storytelling Festival. It occurred once a year across several venues in the valley. The first two were at the Slocan Park Hall. It is a former schoolhouse turned over to a group of dedicated volunteers for a community center in Slocan Park. They have worked extremely hard and put on many fabulous Dukobor meals with borscht and perahe, Varaniki, and other delights. It houses the Slocan Valley Recreation Commission, where Craig was the director for many wonderful years. It also houses the seniors' teas and fundraising events, holiday parties, the lions' pig roasts, sports events, mothers' gatherings, and others. And now, an excellent children's playground. Um, these, these storytelling festivals had um, Craig organized a whole variety of different kinds of people to tell these stories. Some were professional storytellers who he'd run into at some storytelling festival elsewhere. And some were local and that, you know, storytelling, like people like, um, Lynn Frederick, and Carolyn McTaggart, and Susan Holland, and, um, and people who, Barry Gray, who are people who actually go around and, are, and raced others and are paid to tell stories in various events and things. But many of these people are community people. They're, but they're, oftentimes they're actors in theater, and so, and then they've decided to tell a particular story about an aspect of their lives or an aspect of the history of the community. Or there are politicians like Corky Evans who has a million wonderful stories that take us from here to here and when we get there we really figured out that there's a moral to his stories and and there's an admonishment to grow and think about the life. And then there are people like Rita Moyer and Anne de Grace, who are authors and have written incredible stories. And now we ask them to stand up and talk about those stories. But they're, they're authors, and so they read their stories. So, but there's all kinds. Jane Sinclair <laughs> is... Um, is, uh, grew up in South Africa, and she comes with some fascinating stories. So I encourage you to wander your way through this series of videos, and um, I'm really pleased to have been the person to videotape them over the years. I didn't get every single year, but I got many of them, and I would like to say an incredibly deep thanks to Danny Leeming and Abriel Stolz, who um, rose to the call to help me separate all these videos into pieces and give them titles. And isn't it wonderful to work with the high school and this wonderful new program at the high school called the Performing uh, the Performance and Media Academy, where young people are really being taught um, and are learning and are also doing community service, just like so many people here in the Slocan Valley.